Guys, today I'm going to be doing my top five first mods on your Seat Ibiza FR or any Seat Ibiza actually. First mod I'm going to start with, uh, ignore the dirt that was on the badge, but it's going to be decreasing the badges. I also need to do the grill, but I'll do that in a different video. So, uh, wrapping the badges or painting them, plastic dip, anything like that. I haven't actually done the rear one. That's it before chrome. I also like to debadge it at some point if I can. Second mod I'm going to mention is the Sunstrip. Um, I think this is a mint mod for how cheap it is. It's literally just a piece of vinyl which you can pick up off eBay for literally £4. And you can either pay like a tenner to get fitted or fit yourself. Easier with two people but possible on your own. This looks really good. Get it in any colour you want. Set on the inside. Third mod on the list is going to be the wide mouth grill uh, wrap, which is when you wrap that little lower section lip and it creates the wide mouth look. I think it just looks way more aggressive. Um, it just really blends in, especially on white. You can vinyl wrap that or plasti dip. Next mod, going back up to the Sunstrip, is going to be this white pinstriping. Just pinstriping it raw, any colour, just makes it pop off that tiny extra bit. It's always the little details. You can also do the wind deflectors, which I haven't got round to yet, uh, yet sorry, but I probably will next time. Yeah, like I said, it's the little things which count. I did have that little section there pinstriped, but it came off. Uh, it's probably not the right material to be honest with you. Fifth and final uh, first mod for your set Ibiza, in my opinion, this could be different for anybody else, is going to be the spoiler lip. I think that just, just literally finishes off the rear end. I think that looks amazing, in my opinion. Way more aggressive. There isn't many companies which offer these for the new Ibiza. 6F, mainly because of how new it is, but if you look hard enough, you can definitely find one that's just finished in carbon fiber. It just honestly looks so good, whether you bond it on, whether you 3M tape, um, it just looks great in my opinion. Finishes off the rear end. So the spoiler lip was £60 second hand on the Facebook marketplace. Sunstrip was £3 off of eBay um, we, and I had some spare vinyl left over which I used for the front badge but I'll get to that in a minute so that was £3 and I fit it so that was free so £3 overall roll of pinstripe was £4 got that off eBay still got plenty left at home um, that wasn't even a quarter used on the Sunstrip the front badge for me was free because I used the vinyl that was left over from the Sunstrip. However, uh, you can literally pick up black vinyl for £2 you can get in a small piece. And the wide mouth grill also cost me £3 because I used the Sunstrip vinyl. Another roll. Uh, I probably used a good three quarters of that. So overall, to change the complete look of the car, I paid £70, which is really good in my opinion this vid this whole video is based on my opinion and without the spoiler lip i would have literally spent 10 pound on transforming the front end these wheels also need spray and black or maybe replace them but at the least spray and black i like i like them a lot the design just not the color got the chameleon front tints which are pink, but the camera's not picking it up very well. But yeah, like and subscribe.